Okay, this is a WordPress tip from GoCloud Communications, GoCloud.com. We're talking today about permalinks. Permalinks are shorthand in WordPress world for permanent links. They are the links that a person would use to go to various pages or posts on your website. A setting for permanent link is under here, settings. You want to set up how permalinks are going to display. You have a lot of different choices in WordPress and so the default is to give it with a number. That doesn't really make too much sense because that doesn't really describe what the page is. It's always a good idea to have your permanent links, uh, your links describe what the page is. So I would recommend either day and name, month and name, or post name. In this case we've gone with post name. You can also do a custom structure if you want to. And uh, we're just going to keep it as that. So I'm going to go back to that post where we were. But you can make any of these changes. And you can see, right, this part, let me say this, the domain is always going to stay the same. But this part is going to change. So let's go back to that post. We're going to hit back. Now, this post was already published. You can see that. It's all about lemons and roses. And here is the whole permalink. Right, so if you wanted to tell someone about this page or send them a link on how to get there, there it is highlighted right now. But let's say after a while, for whatever reason, you've decided, I don't really want the lemons, just want the roses. So you can delete that at a title because this is the title of the, the post. It's, it's all about roses now. No, no lemons. We're going to update it. Now, we've updated the post, the title is correct, and all the information in the post is correct now, but look at the permalink. It still talks about lemons. Well, that's going to be misleading to search engines, and it's going to be misleading to visitors, too. So we want to change that. How do we do that? Very simple. Just delete. Delete that and say OK, and watch what happens. Now, the new permalink is all about roses. We hit Update. And voila, our page is updated. The permalink is updated as well. Now there's a problem though, which is if people are used to that permalink all about lemons and roses and they go to visit that now, they're going to get what's called the 404, the dreaded, what I call the dreaded 404 page not found error. So you're going to want to set up what's called a redirection um, if that page is now, or post has permanently been moved to all about roses. That is to say again, all about lemons and roses. That link doesn't exist anymore. Now it's just all about roses. Set up the redirect to from all about lemons and roses to all about roses and we will save the tutorial on how to do redirections for another time. But you definitely want to be thinking about that. Otherwise people will hit that site, that old post or page and get an error message and you don't want that on your website. So that's all we got today. Permalinks on WordPress a tip from Goat Cloud Communications, goatcloud.com. Hope you enjoyed, and I hope uh, you put it to good use. Bye-bye.